It's here that you'll find Pierre Scarry. He's a telecom engineer by trade, but has spent most of his adult life making an absolutely perfect scale model of the Ferrari 312 PB. He not only had to make every single part himself, but he also had to make and design the mould for every single part. I wanted to make something uh, like a dream. A Ferrari which we can have in the dining room. It could cost uh, a lot of money to make such a car. For me, it cost maybe 20,000 hours because I had no money. It was my uh, challenge to learn how to make everything in, uh, in this car. I just took photographs of the real car and I made all my drawings from this photograph. How long did it take you to do the drawings for it? Three years. To make the car, 12 years. When I was young, I saw the I saw Ferrari in many races, and uh, my dream was to get this sound, this music, at home. I could not buy one. I had to make one. Now it's all right. Music isn't a bad translation. The main reason why this took 15 years to make is that under the body, you'll find a scaled down version of the original engine, which actually works. It makes the Ferrari music. I made that engine all by myself because I had to make it to get the right sound. I had to make a 12 cylinders engine. But I mean, that's just unbelievable. So what, you turn the, pi the, the piston going up and down? Yes, it is fuel injected and dry sump. <laughs> and this, yeah, this is a 100cc uh, 12, flat 12 with a. Uh, 24 valves because this is a four-stroke engine. Hold on, you, you made, don't tell me you made the valves. Yes, uh, here is <laughs> a valve. And the valve springs here. <laughs> I put four, uh, five gears and reverse. Also. You've done the reverse? Yes, reverse, yes. And so the uh, gearbox works? Yes, yes, it works. Does it drive the wheels? Yes, yes, sure. So the car will actually work? Yes, the car could, could run if uh, we could find someone to drive it. Amazingly, he now wants to make another one, a Ferrari P4 perhaps, or maybe a Ford GT40. But this time he wants to use outside help, which means he has to sell the original. It's worth many, many thousands of pounds, but I can conceive of no finer toy.